Nintend done it again? Details of the SnowRunner Year 3 Pass are already starting to emerge. This time, courtesy of the Nintendo Store and Friends. I've always been a fan of Nintendo, partly because of the original Pokemon games, Kirby, Mario Kart, Conker's Bad Fur Day, and many other classic titles that I will not list because you would probably fall asleep. But I am also a fan of Nintendo because it likes to put placeholders up for game DLCs. In this instance, the mysterious Year 3 Pass, already officially announced, now has names for each season of content. So the juicy store description reads, Expand your SnowRunner experience with the Year 3 Pass and gain access to four phases of new content with new vehicles, new maps, add-ons, and more! Exclamation mark. You will also get instant access to the exclusive Save the Day Vinyl Rat Pack, adding four exclusive skins for the Freightliner M916, Freightliner 114SD, International HX520, and Chevrolet Kodiak C70, it concludes. Then we see the words coming soon, which means the follow-up to Season 8 Grand Harvest, review on the channel, may be arriving on the public test server this month, or more likely, early next year. In case you think this is a big hoax designed to generate YouTube views so I can retire early and live in the Bahamas, the Year 3 Pass store description and names are the same on Epic, Microsoft, Xbox, Sony, and Steam. What about the names? Well, each game store says they are Season 9 Renew and Rebuild, Season 10 Fix and Connect, Season 11 Lights and Cameras, and Season 12 Expansion 3. Yes, as before, Sabre Interactive is holding back the name of what could be the final expansion for SnowRunner. More on that a little later. Remember that we had to wait a while to learn Season 8 was called Grand Harvest. Anyway, let's do some investigation. Magnifying glass and posh British accent at the ready. Having crawled through the Year 3 Pass on every store, the release dates seem like placeholders. It also appears there are no images of the Year 3 Pass. You do get a nice sunset for the Save the Day vinyl rat pack, however, which is probably from Season 8, or some sort of nuclear explosion or forest fire. Said paid DLC is included with the Year 3 Pass, or purchasable separately for two and a half pounds or equivalent. Bonus points if you can name each map in the background. Now forgive me for getting a bit conspiracy theory here, but one of the skins has a film reel. Therefore, it could represent Season 11 lights and cameras, right? If so, does that mean Season 9 Renew and Rebuild means bringing civilization back from the fires of hell? Well, lead producer Mr. Esserokin ruled out war as a theme in SnowRunner because, you know, sensitivity. So maybe these are just cool artworks with Apache helicopters, soldiers, flames, boats, and unidentified green gases. War is not the only option though. You could need to renew and rebuild after a natural disaster, such as a forest fire, earthquake, or flood. Meanwhile, Lights and Cameras seems likely to be a film set map where you need to move movie props around or be part of the movie, stuntman style. What about Fix and Connect? Well, my educated guess would be to do with telecommunications or pipelines, or a road network. Ooh, is this a highway map? Let's not get carried away. Interestingly, the Epic Games, Microsoft, PlayStation, and Steam stores, but not yet Nintendo, have a Year 1, Year 2, and Year 3 Pass package deal for around 60 to 80 British pounds or equivalent in your currency. Now, if I am not mistaken, and it happens a lot, so probably, we never had that with the Year 1 or Year 2 Pass, unless I missed the Year 1 Anniversary, Year 2 Anniversary, and Year 3 Anniversary Edition bundles. If I am not just blind, that is a pretty big hint that we are nearing the end of the road for SnowRunner. Meaning maybe in 2024 we could see the sequel, if there is one. What a shame it would be if we missed out on more part peaceful, part rage inducing off-road trucking. Speaking of which, it will be tough to guess what Season 12 new expansion is without even so much as a word or image, but I am curious how Sabre Interactive will end on the third and maybe final year of DLC deliciousness. And on that note, subscribe and like for more gaming videos from a cynical old Brit.
The road to 100,000 subs has begun, and I would love you to be a part of it. Yes, I'm looking at you. Until next time, take care. Bye.